Verse 10, therefore, my brothers and sisters, make every effort to confirm your calling and election, for if you do these things, you will never what? Stumble, and you will receive a rich welcome into the eternal kingdom of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. How many want to pick up the phone when Jesus calls? So Jesus calls you up and says, I got a calling for you. You want to pick it up and be like, hello, Jesus, what's going on? And he's like, well, I've called you to be a man of God. Yes, sir, I'll do it. I've called you to be pure and holy. Yes, sir. You know, and then you want to say something like this, husbands, after God's talked to you. You want to say, now will you talk to my wife? Here she is. And then she's like, who is it? Oh, it's Jesus. Okay, hey, Jesus. Well, I want you to be a godly wife. I want you to be a godly mom. Yeah, uh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. That's how we live for Jesus. We make sure and confirm our calling an election because I believe Jesus elected me to be his son. I believe he elected you to be a son or daughter. How many believe Jesus picked you out and said, I want that one. I want that one. Amen. I want this one and that one and this one from every nation, tribe and, and tongue. He said he picked us, he called us, but it's up to us to confirm it. And be like, yep, I want the reservation. Put my name down, Jesus. I want to go to heaven. I run a rich welcome when I get there. I don't want you to say, depart from me. I never knew you. You're a worker of sin. You're a doer of evil. I want to get to heaven and him welcome me and say, well done, son. Well done, my good and faithful servant. Welcome to the reward I prepared for you.